Hey guys, magandang umaga or magandang gabi depending on what time you're watching this video. My name is Monica and welcome to my channel. I just am getting ready for the first time um, in a really long time. I haven't worn makeup in like months or like properly wanted to wear makeup to go out in ages so I thought I would just film the look for you guys it's also been a really long time since I have filmed like a get ready with me so this is like a chatty video um, just showing you how I like get my full face on so I'm actually not wearing that much makeup and this is basically the most glam I will like ever go in recent days I don't have anything to say <laughs> other than that little intro for you guys so I will just see you in a second with my bare face just out the shower. <laughs> okay, this is me literally straight out the shower. The first thing that I do, obviously, moisturize and everything. I just moisturize my face with Child's Farm. It's a little bit like <laughs> squished now, but the Child's Farm, which I use for my eczema on my face, and then I use this, um, which is like a moisturizer for spots. This is all I use. I don't actually use any, um, any primers because the primer that I've used in the past has um, not really reacted well with my skin. I actually do want to try the, um, what's it called? I like the, the hydrating primer that all the, like, the YouTubers are like hyping about. I'll, if I can remember the name, I'll put it here. Um, I think it's the milk one. I'm not, I'm not sure about that. I know it's green. That's all I know. Anyway, so the first thing that I do is actually I try and set my fringe so that it like dries properly. So I'm just gonna quickly do that. <laughs> Later. So first things first, I'm just going to empty out all of my junk onto my workspace here. If I can find it, I'm just going to use some concealer. As I said, I don't use a primer, so I'm just going to go straight in. I actually haven't used a foundation in months. Like, I haven't used a foundation for almost a year now, I feel. No, lies. Probably the last time you guys saw me using a foundation, which was maybe back in December or something. I just use concealer now. So I've got my Fenty, my Fenty concealer, the hydrating one. It is in the shade 235. Um, I feel like this shade is probably too light for me now considering how much I have tanned in the past few months since I bought it. But your girl doesn't have the money to keep buying makeup when she changes a shade. So what my plan is, um, what everyone should do really is to get their winter shade and their summer shade and so when you're like in between you can like mix them so this looks kind of redundant but i'm actually going to split the fringe now it looks so stupid but i'm sorry that's just what we have to do when we're getting ready and yeah i did set it so that it looks like a fringe and now it's not but you know what that's just that's just life nothing makes sense so i just put a few dots on like some areas that I want to look good. I suppose I had like a spot here. I get like I get like darker, darker skin around like my mustache area. Uh, so I just try. Probably shouldn't talk when I do that. But I just like put some concealer on. I usually put some on my chin, but my chin is looking really good. I do have a little like beauty mark right here. I don't know if you can see, like there. That I don't really like, so we're just gonna cover that up. And this is just like a normal beauty blender. Honestly, it's quite disgusting. I've had this for a really long time, but I wash it. I actually bought a pack of four, but it's like one of those things where it's like, I'm not gonna start the other three yet, because this one is still like technically usable. I don't know if you can tell if that did anything, but I did just cover up a few blemishes that I had. So I'm just gonna go in, sticking with the Fenty theme. I'm gonna go in with my Fenty, my Fenty, Fenty, Fenty bronzer. Whew, tongue twister if I ever knew one. I'm not actually sure what shade this is. Oh, it's Island Ting. And I just bronze up. So the reason that I'm getting kind of glam tonight is that one of my best friends is finally going to university and she's going all the way to Leeds. So far away is she's basically going to Scotland, okay? Like, how could she do this to me? But no, I'm really proud of her. She's finally like following her dreams. 
she's finally doing it but I'm really gonna miss her because literally since before I can remember she's always been we're just gonna fix this hairline she's always been literally up the road from me like whenever we wanted to just hang out I could just call her and she would be basically there like we even worked together in the same restaurant for a few years she's like the first best friend that I can really remember having I'm bronzing this like I'm gonna be showing my forehead to the world it's not gonna happen then again after a few cocktails you get sweaty so I'm probably gonna be <laughs> lifting everything back at one point <laughs> god am I gonna do my brows today I haven't actually done my brows in a really long time Partially because I feel like with my the lashes that I use now, they're quite natural So I feel like if I did my brows with like a natural lash, it would not be balanced out very well But I am doing a face A face Like a full face sort of So maybe I should We'll see, there we go I'm gonna do my brows I need to go really close to the mirror to do this, so I'm actually gonna do this off camera. Five minutes later. Okay, that is my brows done. They're a bit rusty, they're a little bit rusty. But I don't really do a lot to my brows anyway because they're quite because they're quite thick. I'm not gonna lift it up for you guys, but this is the powder that I use it. Okay, I'll lift up the lid. I'll lift up the lid if you guys can read it. The Rimmel, just the the clear, the clear um, finishing powder or clarifying powder. Just this translucent powder. Um, and I have, okay, I am gonna show you. I have like completely, I dropped it and then it's all gone crumbly, but I can't be bothered to buy a new one and they're not that expensive, honestly, but it's, um, it's mainly to do with the fact that it's not unusable just because it's broken. You can still use it. <laughs> so I don't see why I would need to buy a new one. Okay, so that's done. I don't put a lot on. I do not bake because it is because <laughs> because it is drying and my skin cannot hack that. Then again, I haven't even put anything under my eyes to bake anyway. You know what? We're gonna do it just because we're not actually looking that sleepy, honestly. But we're just gonna do it anyway. So this is all I put on my face. Where is my sponge? Here. We're going to use this blush because it is the only other powder blush. You cannot even see it. It is faded. It is the Too Faced blush. I don't... It is the color Love Hangover. Dab my brush in here. Dab a little bit off. Blow it. Make my cheeks like this. And then I just spread it out. I'm going to go back into the powder. I basically use the powder to try and like blend everything in nicely so I've been seeing the biggest spiders in my house lately and on I, when I tell you that I haven't seen a spider in my house in like two years I'm not even lying and then suddenly like the past month I have been seeing so many and they're like they're not like daddy long legs I'm not actually scared of daddy long legs but what we have been seeing in this house are like outdoor spiders like they belong outside you can see like the shape of them they're the ones that you see like on a bush, like that I've made like a huge web and they're in the middle. They're disgusting. Lately I have just been using bronzer as an eyeshadow. So that's what we're gonna do. We're using the same Fenty bronzer. I feel like it makes everything look more cohesive when you're kind of using the same color for everything. And then actually because why not, um, we're gonna go in with my first ever palette that I've got. Bought Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics palette. So I'm just gonna go into the. I always use this color first. Oh, I don't know how to how to show you guys this. Oh god. Oh god. It's so awkward. Okay. So this one you can see like the really dirty one. <laughs> that's the that's the one I use like all the time uh, for transition. And then I'll probably go into this one and then those two as well at some point. Um, just because that's kind of like the basic eye that I go for. Honestly, I probably don't need the first shade because I've already put the bronzer on. So we're gonna go in the second shade now. We're going to the last shade now, the darkest shade 
from like the browns in the palette just on the outside I kind of just do this thing where I kind of just layer them all on top of each other going back into like the lighter ones if you need to like blend a little bit more just to try and make it cohesive just trying to make it look like there's some sort of gradient so we're gonna do the bottom lash line now which I probably should do after I put my lashes on but whoops we're doing it now so we're just gonna have to deal with that so that's kind of Kind of what we're looking like. I use the same brush that I'm using. I'm not. I don't tell you guys what brushes that I use because I literally get these brushes from like TK Maxx. <laughs> I feel like a brush kind of does its job. <laughs> wow, I put too much on. Wowza, can you guys see that? That is a lot. Oh my gosh, you can actually see. It's like, it's like a, a line. I've just drawn a line. I feel like it's because my nose is sweating. My nose always sweats when I do my makeup. Who's with me? Like. So stupid. <laughs> yes, I feel like the color is is sticking more. It's fine. We will we will fix it. We're just gonna try and blend, blend, blend. Right. We're just gonna try and fix this mess. We're gonna go back in with our big fluffy brush. Just keep blending. That's kind of the. The trick to makeup, isn't it? Just keep blending. I am not an expert on makeup at all. As you can see, everything's a mess. Promise it comes together. I promise. <laughs> am, I, am I convincing you or am I convincing myself at this point? We don't know. We shall see. I think I'm gonna put my lashes on now because that can go one of two ways. I can either be done in five seconds or I can be there for ages and I don't have time to be dilly-dallying. So I'm gonna quickly do my brows and I will be right. I said brows. I'll quickly do my lashes and I will be right back. <laughs> okay, so the lashes are on now. I think it's coming together a bit more now that the lashes are on. I have actually changed, if you can just see the top. Ow, I hit my powder. Oh, it's everywhere. <laughs> I love this top because it comes with a scrunchie. What? So when I do my hair later, we're gonna be using that. We're gonna utilize it. This is actually the first time I've worn this top and it's actually so nice. Okay, so what I didn't actually do, I didn't put a center color. We didn't put like a shimmer or anything on the lid and I feel like it is in dire need of that. Oh, we could go for something in our Urban Decay heat palette. Yeah, I feel like we could go for a shimmer in here. So we're gonna use the shade Lumber. It's probably not gonna match and I'm probably gonna mess up my lashes. Oh no. All right, it's fine. It's quite, it's quite sheer. I think I dipped into the wrong color. Oh well. I'm just trying to use another color that's in here. So that's it for the eyes, I think. Um, no, I'm gonna put some mascara on, just on the bottom lashes actually. So I use like really basic <laughs> Maybelline lash sensation. I feel like I should have brought you guys in closer when I was doing my eyes. Too late now. Okay, so what we clearly missed is the highlight. So we're gonna be doing that. Right, so I tend to use this. Um, it's the Rimmel one. It's like, a, it's like a little kit, you've probably seen me use it before. I use the highlight, which is the top one. Just to like add a little bit of summit, summit. Put a little bit on the inner. Ooh, that just adds a little bit of pop, doesn't it? A little bit of pop. Probably put too much on, but who's gonna clock us? No one. That's that done. I think that is it for the face, I don't spray anything on it. It is hair time guys. Let's let's do this. We're almost there. We have about 20 minutes until we have to walk out that door. But I'm gonna check in on my girl and see if she's like running late as well. Which is what we tend to hope for because then we can all run late together. We are gonna try and make the hair look presentable. This is kind of like my go-to hairstyle now. Just put it up in half up, half down ponytail. I use these like thin 
hair bands, and we just tie it up. And then that would be it, but we really, really want to use scrunchie but there's a really long label oh it actually does say to cut it I was gonna say I'm gonna cut it because I don't care but it actually says to cut it so I'll be right back <laughs> we're just gonna put that right around where we've already tied our little ponytail does that look cute oh, it does look cute okay so we're gonna try and fix this fringe I do use my straighteners a lot recently because the fringe is just not cooperating with me. I'm debating what lipstick that I should be wearing today. I always say that I only have like one lipstick, which is actually a lie. I have quite a lot last year when Rihanna released all those like, was it like her Galaxy collection? I actually basically bought like all the colors in it. <laughs> so I'm actually gonna try some of those today because of what I'm wearing. I feel like the nude one might look nice. Protect your face best you can, but I did just spray my mouth. I think I'm gonna brush my teeth so that I can start doing the lips. Soon after. This color from the Galaxy Fenty collection is Starlit. This is the lipstick, and then the lip gloss is Spacesuit. Honestly, I don't know why I keep forgetting that I have these. They're so pretty. Oh, the gloss is sticky. Maybe I should actually zoom in. Okay. Oh, that's so <laughs> Should've just done that. Can you see that? That's kind of like luminous. Wow, that is so nice. Oh, since I'm in, I'm just gonna like show you guys like the eye look. Like how my face looks. The lashes, I love these lashes. Let's see like, how the brows are looking today. Pretty decent, I would say. Yeah, so I think that is it for today's video, guys. Um, this is the final look. I am quite excited about tonight. This is the first time I've like dressed up in a really long time. Hoping to get some good pictures for the gram on it. Speaking of which, if you're not following my socials, they are linked down below. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching if you stayed until this point and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys! <laughs>